We also have one step equations that also involve uh, multiplication and division. And for our example for that, we have 5x is equal to 75. Now again, the um, method is still the same. You're going to do the opposite or the inverse operation. Here, 5 is being multiplied by x, so therefore, we're going to divide 5 on both sides. And when we evaluate on both sides, we get 5 divided by 5, which is 1x. Um, we're just going to put the x here. In algebra, we have to remember, we normally don't see the number 1 in front of a variable because it's understood to be there when the variable is standing alone. 1 really shows up when it has to. In this case, it doesn't necessarily have to be there. There's nothing wrong with having 1x there, but it's not necessary. So we have x is equal to, and then we evaluate 75 divided by 5. It is 15. And again, it's a good practice to always check your work. So when we check, we have 5 times 15, and of course when you evaluate that, you get the answer is equal to 75. So I'm going to reiterate that again. It's very important that you check um, your work. After each, after you go through each and every problem, it's no harm to be extra sure. All right. In our next example, we also have a negative seven y is equal to twenty eight. 